Hi. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to add more work zones or workstations to Radio Boss so you have more room to play or work, I should say. Um, basically, what we see here is the default set of the program. We've got playlist one, playlist two, and on the right hand side, you've got, or the left hand side, I should say, you've got the file explorer, the file lookup, the scheduler, and then the equalizer. And right below, you've got log. But in our last video, we talk about how to add sound effects. It involves adding more workstations. So we wanted to make a video of just how to add more workstations. You have an idea of how to add more room to play and to work on when it comes to Radio Boss. So to do that, there's a couple different icons you can choose. Here at the toolbar, we see here left panel, work zones one, two, three, and work zones additional. So if we click work zones two, right here on the right hand side, you're going to see that our screen just popped up. And if we click the plus button, we can add an aux playlist, cart wall, search, file explorer, notepad. Um, we can give it a name here, and then we can type, 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 type. So basically what we did here is we added more workstations or pretty much empty slots where we can add our own content. So the same could have been, for example, let's say here we go back to the toolbar. We click work zones three. Right below it, it adds another one. So I can also pretty much change the size of each. We click on the plus button, and we can add a cart wall. We can give it a name. We can put jingles. And just like that in our video uh, where we talk about sound effects, we have this screen here where we can add our own sound effects. So pretty much this is what the work zones or workstations would be in Radio Boss. Let's say you want another one just because two isn't enough for you. You can go ahead and click on work zones additional, the last icon here at the toolbar, and it opens one up automatically just like that. And we can add an aux playlist. We can give it a name, playlist, and just like that, we pretty much have more workstations showing up. And if we click it again, it'll pretty much bring us up another one. So right now we've got two different workstations. So there's a couple different things you can do when it comes to uh, Radio Boss and pretty much enlarging the amount of room you have to work. So this was basically a video just showing you and explaining about how the work zones work and how to activate them. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them in the comment section below and we're happy to help. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day.